TGIF guys, happy Friday. Thanks for being here with us today. I'm gonna warm you up nice and quick today because we've got lots to do. So we're gonna take a breath in and sigh. Another one, way up to the top and all the way to the bottom. Three sirens. sing a song, a warm-up song we've done before. As we sing together, raise your voice on high. Here we go. As we sing together, raise your voice on high. Sing up to the mountain, sing up to the sky. We're going to do that again, and if you know that this is a canon, so when one part gets to, as we sing together, raise your voice on high. When they start raise, the next part layers on top. So it'd be, as we sing together, as we sing together, and so on. So I'm gonna sing, and I'm gonna point when it's your turn to start that next part, and we'll see if you can make a canon at home. Here we go. As we sing together, raise your voice on high. Sing out to the mountain, sing out to the sky. Nice, let's see if we can do that twice through and then we'll be nice and warm. Here's our new starting note and as we sing together, raise your voice on high. Sing out to the mountain, sing out to the sky. As we sing together, raise your voice on high. Sing out to the mountain, sing out to the sky. Nice, short and sweet, we're ready to sing. Hi guys, right now we're going to add to um, the song Small Voices. We learned a little bit of that last week and we've been learning it in class of course, but we worked on it last week and we're going to add to that. So we had just finished one section and the next section starts with, I have seen a flower. I have seen a flower. All right, so try that with me and. I have seen a flower. I have seen a flower. And then the next part, treble one and treble two, you both sing this together. It goes like this. Listen to the raindrops falling softly. Try that with me and. Listen to the raindrops falling softly. Good. Now treble one, you finished that line singing. Can you hear the sound they're making? Try that with me. Can you hear the sounds they're making? Nice. So let's do that whole line. Treble one, you continue on. Treble two, just sing the first half with them and then wait. I'll show you what your part is next. Listen to the raindrops falling softly. Can you All right, treble two, you get to sing. Listen to the raindrops falling softly. Can you hear the sounds they're making? Try that with me. Listen to the raindrops falling softly. Can you hear the sounds they're making? Okay, so now we're gonna sing that same line. Honestly, we do that exact same thing now four times in a row. So that's pretty interesting because sometimes you have to ask yourself in music, if we're going to repeat this over and over, what's the point of that? What's, what am I trying to say? Why am I saying the same thing over and over? So as you're doing this, think about that. Why might you be repeating this line over and over? I'm going to sing the treble one part this time through and I'll play the treble two as we go. So we're going to start at, I have seen the flower. One, two, this is everybody. I have seen a flower. I have seen a flower. Everyone, listen to the raindrops falling softly. Can you hear the sound they're making? Listen to the raindrops falling softly. Can you hear the sound they're making? Listen to the raindrops falling softly. Can you hear the sound they're making? Listen to the raindrops falling softly. Can you hear the sound they're making? 
Okay, now one more time through that, and this time I will sing the treble two part and play the treble one at the same time. I have seen a flower, here we go. I have seen a flower. I have seen a flower. Everyone, listen to the raindrops falling softly. little bit of that section we sing I have seen a flower again I have seen a flower I have seen a flower try that with me and I have seen a flower I have seen a flower nice job guys um, as always go back and re review this by just rewinding the video if you need to it's been about four minutes and 15 seconds so if you go back that far you'll be able to um, have another crack at this bye all right, so in our first week of online song, Song at Home, we started working on a game called Sevens, and many of you know it already, and if you do, you know we only got halfway through. So to remind you, Sevens is the, it, we uh, use our lap to make rhythm patterns, and we got all the way up to the fourth pattern, the hardest pattern, but we didn't go backwards back through the patterns. That's what we're gonna do today. So let's slowly just review each pattern once through, um, so the first pattern is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Repeat one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The second one is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The next one, a little harder. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And the last one is the trickiest. You might need to take some time to practice before you're ready, but let's give it a go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So the game goes up through those four patterns to the hardest one, and then goes right back down through them in reverse order till we end up back at this one. We're gonna give it a try nice and slow, and then we'll see if we can speed it up. One, two, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 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 All right, hopefully that wasn't too hard. We're gonna try it again a little bit faster. And um, if it helps you to count out loud with me, go for it. Here we go. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 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 All right, now show that to your siblings or your parents and beat them at it. Tongue twisters are good for diction, so let's do one this morning. I'll say it once and then we'll take it apart. Here we go. Betty Botter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. So she bought some better butter, and the butter wasn't bitter, so it was better. Betty Botter bought some better butter. Whoa. Okay, so let's take it apart. I'll say a line, and you say it back, and watch my arm for the tempo. First line, Betty Botter bought some butter. Your turn. Betty Butter bought some butter. Next line. But she says the butter's bitter. Your turn. But she says the butter's bitter. Let's do that whole line. 
Betty Botter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. Your turn. Betty Botter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. Next line. If I put some batter in my butter, what? If I put some batter in my butter, your turn. If I put some batter in my butter, next line. That will make my batter bitter, your turn. That will make my batter bitter. Let's do that whole line. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. Your turn. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. That's the middle of this thing. So let's do it from the beginning to there. Me first, then you. Betty Butter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. Your turn. Betty Butter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. Okay, second half. Me first. So she bought some better butter. Your turn. So she bought some better butter. Next line. And the butter wasn't bitter. Your turn. And the butter wasn't bitter. Let's do that whole line. So she bought some better butter and the butter wasn't bitter. Here's the very last line. So it was better Betty Butter bought some better butter. Your turn. So it was better Betty Butter bought some better butter. Let's do the second half all together. Me first, then you. So she bought some better butter and the butter wasn't bitter. So it was better Betty Butter bought some better butter. Your turn. So she bought some better butter and the butter wasn't bitter. So it was better Betty Butter bought some better butter. All right. Now we're going to say it all the way through. No stops. Me first. Betty Butter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. So she bought some better butter, and the butter wasn't bitter, so it was better. Betty Butter bought some better butter. Okay, now I'm going to slow it down a little bit, and you can take a breath in the middle. I wanted to do it without a breath, but let's slow it down the first time we do it and take breaths where we need them. Here we go. Betty Butter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. So she bought some better butter, and the butter wasn't bitter. So it was better Betty Butter bought some better butter. All right, now let's go a little faster. Watch my arm for the tempo change. Betty Butter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. So she bought some better butter, and the butter wasn't bitter. So it was better Betty Butter bought some better butter. A little faster. Watch my temp arm for the tempo change. Betty Butter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. So she bought some better butter, and the butter wasn't bitter. So it was better Betty Butter bought some better butter. This time, I'm going to go as fast as I can, and let's see if you can beat me. All right, let's see who gets to the end first. On your mark, get set, go. Betty Butter bought some butter, but she says the butter's bitter. If I put some batter in my butter, that will make my batter bitter. So she bought some better butter, and the butter wasn't bitter, so it was better. Betty Butter bought some better butter. Whew. Okay, I'm going to go make some cookies.